welcome to Proclaim, a presentation of the Catholic Diocese of Alexandria. Join us as we journey together through the scriptures revealed to us by God. Good morning and welcome to Proclaim. As we look at this gesture of the woman breaking the jar of very expensive perfumed oil and pouring it on Jesus' head, the reaction, particularly among his disciples, is not in some way that she has insulted Jesus or somehow she has made a mess or something that we would be perhaps inclined to think would be the objection, but it takes a different form. It says, there were some who were indignant. Why has this been the waste of this perfumed oil? It could have been sold for more than 300 days wages and the money given to the poor. It's nice that they're concerned about the poor. Jesus will see a different significance in this though because as he will say, you can always help the poor. That basically is why he sees beyond what's interpreted as waste to the symbolism of preparation for what lies ahead, something that his disciples, at least up to this point, have clearly misunderstood, have been unwilling to accept, even though he has told them on several occasions that he's going to Jerusalem to suffer and die, put to death as a criminal. And yet, because that doesn't fit their expectations, it doesn't fit what they believe the time of the Messiah should be, they simply have chosen to not hear that, or at least to not accept it or understand it. Jesus will see this action by this unnamed woman who has come into where he was dining in the house of Simon the leper as something very significant, far beyond what his disciples and the others in the room with them are able to perceive. Once again, we're drawn to look beyond the time and place to the meanings that lie deeper. This program was brought to you by Antoon Enterprises.